Three players have joined us all hoping they'll experience jackpot joy today. Good luck to them all. They're going to need it. This is Tipping Point. Hello and welcome to Tipping Point. Three players will be facing our machine and they're all hoping to win thousands today. So, let's meet them. I'm Hermione, a sports science student from Lincolnshire. I'm Daniel, an account manager from Maidenhead. And I'm Alison, a bank cashier from Motherwell. Good luck to you all. Let's play Tipping Point. In round one, you each start with three counters. Questions are on the buzzer. If you buzz in and give me a correct answer, you'll have a choice to make. You can either choose to play one of your counters into the machine or if you think the machine isn't quite ready, get one of your opponents to play one of theirs instead. Most of the counters you get out of the machine will add £50 to your score. That includes our mystery counters, which of course come with a bonus prize. But also nestled in the machine, we do have two double counters. One of those falls for you, it will double the entire value of your drop. And should one fall with the jackpot counter at the end of the game, you'll be leaving £20,000 richer. Now, all three of you will go through to play in round two, but you need to bank as much money as you can to stay in the game. So do keep an eye on those double counters because they could make all the difference. Right then, everyone ready? Yep. Hands on your buzzers to come to your first question. Drinks in the Collins family of cocktails are typically made using the juice of which yellow citrus fruit? Hermione. Lemon. Lemon is absolutely right, yes. So you get to make the first choice. Would you like to play or pass the first counter? I'd like to pass, please. To Daniel or Alison? To Daniel, because we've got a bit of a rivalry going on. <laughs> Thank you, OK. It's competition here. Nice. I like it. Right then, Daniel, let's see what we can do. Where do you want to go? Uh, drop zone three. Let's give it a go. Let's fire up the drop zone three. Here we go, then. Oh, no. Come on, that's go flat. Sign. Stayed up on its edge. Hopefully you'll be all right. Stayed yeah, you are. Right. OK. Can we get anything over the top shelf here for you, Daniel? That looks good. Doesn't look bad at the yeah. moment, Alison, does it? Looks Come on. Good. Yes, oh. there you go. And this is Tipping Point going to go. Oh, oh. Yay. One Yay. count sneaks in. Never easy to get that first one to pay out. Even £50 is decent. Let's take it from the machine, put it in your bank, and you've still got two left to pay down. Here's your next question. In 2021, which James Bond actor was honoured with a star on the Hollywood Walk of Fame? Hermione. Daniel Craig. Daniel Craig is right. You ready to play yet? Um, no, I'm going to pass it again, please. Who are you going to pass it to? To Alison this time. Alison, I'll be you're nice. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Right, where are you going to go, Alison? I think I'll go with drop zone three. Let's do it. Fire up three, please. <laughs> Smooth slider. Settles well. Oh, I don't think it's ready. Oh, there you go. Ooh, it looks a yeah. bit better now, doesn't it? Come it's spread. On. Oh, oh no. but not on the bottom shelf. So nothing for you, I'm afraid, Alison. You've still got two left. Thank you. Here's your next question. In 2022, NASA's New Horizons mission discovered ice volcanoes on which dwarf planet in our solar system? Hermione. Pluto. It is Pluto, yeah. Great answer, that one. Now, ready to play or are you going to pass again? Um, I'm going to pass again. Who please. are you passing to? So Daniel. Right then, Daniel. Hermione's dictating play as things stand. Let's see if we can make her pay. Where are you going to go? Um, I'm going to try drop zone four, I think, this time. Change attack. Go for drop zone four. So we've got one last time. What can we get this time? Hopefully on the left, I'd imagine. Yeah. Hard to do. Let's right. see if we can get that mystery down a little bit. Yeah, bring it forward. Looks OK. Oh, it is riding. Oh, I think it is. It is Sorry. riding. They're tightly packed, though. You might get that black one in the corner over. Come on. Go on, go on. Yes, yeah. it is. That'll do. Well, well done. That is the tipping point, really. Mm. No, it's not. So nothing from your second counter. Here's your next question. In 2007, Steve Jobs launched which mobile device by referring to it as an iPod, a phone and an internet communicator? Daniel. iPad? No, it's not. It's the iPhone. Ah. Daniel, I'm afraid we have to steal your last counter. That's gone into the penalty pot. You'll all be playing for that at the end of the round. Uh, that's all three used for the time yep. here, Daniel. You're no out. Problem. So, for money, you've still got three counters. Alison, you've got two. Here's your next question. 
In 2021, the Australian national team won the men's T20 World Cup title in which bat and ball sport? Hermione. Cricket. Cricket is right, yes. So, are you ready to play yet? Um, I think I am going to play. OK, where should we go? I think I'm going to go with drop zone four, please. Fire up four. Oh, oh no. It stays on its edge. Let it be flat. Hopefully it'll be OK. You are, yeah, it's flat. Thank gosh. Whether you'll get something over, maybe the black one in the middle. Yeah, it looks good. Uh, oh, oh, no, yeah, okay. yeah, there you yeah. go, still one, and they separated, good. which is nice. Oh, oh well done. Lovely. Well done. Good drop, well done. Waited it out. Five counters for you there, Hermione. 250 pounds. Let's take it from the machine and put it into your bank. And you've got two counters still to play. Next question for you and Alison. The title character of the 2022 BBC TV series Dodger was originally created by which Victorian writer? Alison. Charles Dickens. It is Charles Dickens, yes. Nicely done. Right, do you want to play, Alison? Yes. Could I play Drop Zone 3, please? Ooh, Drop Zone 3 for us, please. There we go. Nice set. Oh, flat. Is that mystery going to come out for you, Alison? Yep. Be nice if it does. Yay. Yes. Ooh. Someone Ooh. just skids up. Oh, no. Oh, oh Alison. Okay. Lucky. <laughs> Sadly, nothing comes out. You're down to your last counter. Here's your next question. In which 1939 film musical does the cowardly lion sing If I Only Had the Nerve? Alison. The Wizard of Oz. The Wizard of Oz is right. Now then, Alison, you got the nerve to play this? Where are you going to go? I'm going to try drop zone three again. OK, we're going for three. Oh. That could be a nice spot because they've just over. shifted over in four as well, haven't they? Oh, yeah. Right, come on, gap, come on, though. come on. No. Oh, 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 <laughs> you managed to get one out. You squeezed <laughs> that one over the tipping point. £50, we'll draw you level with Daniel. Let's put it in your bank. And that's all three of yours okay. used now, so for the time being, you are out. Just right, me. Hermione, Gosh. it is just you. Because it's just you. Right. You don't need to use your buzzer, but you do need to get them right to put the counts into the machine, all right? Okay. Here's your first one. The food brand Glorious is best known for producing which liquid food dish that is typically served hot? Soup. It is soup, yes. Well done. Uh, where should we put this one? I'm going to put it in drop zone four again, please, because there's up. a few on the edge. It looks good, doesn't it? Fire up four. Yeah, the mystery. Okay, it is. I tell you what, it's nice if it goes flat. Oh, no. Oh, it did right for a moment. It's flat. OK. You yeah. are flat. I you need the mystery down. Is it going to go? Yeah. yeah, it does. Well done. Oh, I think that's going to go. Oh, nice. Lovely. Three for you there, Hermione. £150. Let's take that and put it in your bank. That extends your lead. Which on £400. You've got one left to play. Again, you've got to give me the correct answer to put it into the machine. Yep. Here we go. The Olympians were the major gods in the mythology of which ancient civilization? Um, Greek. Yes, Greek or Greece. One last counter, Hermione. Go drop zone four again, please. Let's hit four. Get your timing right. See if we can get it down and flat. Ooh, yeah, there you nice. go. Nice. Good, quick drop and settle. And a couple over the top. This... Mystery's not far. Oh, oh my, oh my God! Well done. Wow. That's a drop. I wasn't expecting that. <laughs> <laughs> 11 counts to Marnie. We have That's done. a cracker to finish Thank with. You. 550 pounds right there. Let's take it, put it in your bank, and then extend your lead. You now have 950 pounds. As things stand, Hermione has £950, both Daniel and Alison have £50 each, but it's not over, because we have one counter up for grabs in the penalty spot. I'm going to ask you all one more question. If you buzz and give me the correct answer, you put this counter into the machine. If you buzz and give me the wrong answer, you will be frozen out. Good luck, everybody. Here comes your penalty spot question. How many days are there in the calendar month of June? Daniel. 30. 30 is absolutely right. Well done. So, we've got a chance here to close the gap a little bit if you can. What's looking good? I think we're going to stay away from four. Um, <laughs> my mind is uh, completely that side. I think um, <laughs> we'll have a go with drop zone two for the first time. All right, let's hit two, please. What 
can we get here? Just to improve your balance. Yeah, OK. That's, right. That's a good start. Gonna get anything over the top, though? Come on. Oh, oh no. It's hanging over. They are. It's on the verge of going, isn't it? Just That's... see, Daniel. I think it can just... That's twice. <laughs> <laughs> That's a shame. Wriggle away from that double, which is keeping it in place. Not going to go, I'm afraid. So, sadly, you managed to win the penalty pot counter, but nothing comes out. So, the scores stay as they were. Hermione is way out in the lead with £950. Both Daniel and Alison have £50 each. So, join us after the break to see which today's three players will win through to our head-to-head -head and a shot at our £10,000 jackpot. See you in a bit. Welcome back to your tipping point where Hermione, Daniel and Alison are battling it out for the right to play for today's jackpot. In this round, they'll each have 45 seconds to answer any questions as possible. Every time they get a question right, they win a counter to play in the machine. However, this time the player with the lowest score at the end of the round will be eliminated from the game. So Hermione, because you have the lead, you can choose. Would you like to play first or would you like to ask Daniel or Alison to play? I'd like to go first, please. OK, 45 seconds for you, Hermione. Every time you get a question mark, I'll give you a counter. If you don't know, just say pass, all right? 45 seconds for Hermione, please. Your time starts now. On which continent is the country of Belgium located? Um, Europe. Correct. The common phrase used when someone must commit to an action or decision is when push comes to what? Shelf. Correct. Which Avengers actor plays the title role in the 2021 Marvel TV series Hawkeye? Pass. Jeremy Renner. What name is given to the tiny pores found on a plant leaf that allow gas exchange? Um, pass. Stomata. By definition, something that is uniocular relates to how many eyes? And one. Correct. Following the general election in 2001, which politician began his second term as UK Prime Minister? Tony Blair. Correct. Guest hosted by Jules Buckley in 2020 and 2021. The Classical Fix is a programme produced by which BBC radio station? Ba Radio 1. Radio 3. Classical Fix. It's all classical music. Uh, radio 3. No uh, idea. Four correct answers in there, Hermione. Not too bad at all. Four counts put into the machine. Where do you want to start? I think I might test out Drop Zone 2. Yeah, let's do it. Bar up two, please. Daniel gave it a little tickle, didn't he? I wonder yeah. if you can get something out. Getting it ready for you. Thanks. <laughs> oh, no. Ooh, now, that it's might cause flat. you an issue if it doesn't go flat. Oh, it is flat, yes. It is flat. Got gosh. away with it. Thank gosh. Can we get that double moving forward? Maybe the black count under it. Yes, Ooh. the black one goes down. Good start. Oh. Ling the tipping point. Nearly. Okay. Three more to go in. I'm going to stick with drop zone two, please. Two again. Just want it to the right side this time. So it rolls a bit further left. Got a little bit of a gap, isn't there? And it's riding oh, as well. No. Oh. Timing's a bit off there. Giving yourself a chance. Let's see if we get something over the top. A little shove. Ooh. Yes, there you go. There you go. Let's go. Here we go. Nicely done. Oh, we have done. That's better. Six counters for you, including the one that jumped out of the machine. Three hundred pounds. Two more to go in. Drop zone two again, please. Let's stay with two, please. Gone left again. True, yeah, just gone to the wrong side. You got a rider over there last time. It's flat this time. Oh. Get that black counter down. There's still a little bit more damage you can do on the bottom shelf, I think. Yeah. Oh, it wasn't oh, quite. No. no, just slid underneath it, didn't it? One more to go then, Hermione. We'll wait it out. We'll go two again, please. Drop zone two. On the right side. Further over to the right. Is that still one going to be? Go flat. On? It is flat, oh, yeah. Nice. Now you can start it's trying a good to spot. harvest. Yeah, it does yeah. feel good, doesn't it, Alison? Can you harvest some of those counters? And... Oh, 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 good. And yeah. maybe three. Maybe get a few more. Ooh. Perfect. Couple more drop in. Let's give you another two. So another hundred pounds takes you up to four hundred pounds. Let's take that from the machine and put it into your bank, Kamani, and that's going to leave you one thousand three hundred and fifty pounds. Nicely done. Fantastic. Right then, Daniel and Alison, you both have £50, but, Alison, by virtue of the fact that you answered the question correctly before Daniel in the last round, you can choose. Would you like to play next or would you like Daniel to play? I'd like to play, please. Right, 45 seconds for Alison, please. 
The time starts now. A pulse rate is a measure of the beats per minute of which organ in the human body? The heart. Correct. How many legs in total does a cockroach typically have? It. Six. In 2021, which Argentinian footballer won the Ballon d'Or award for a seventh time? Uh, Madonna. Lionel Messi. <laughs> <laughs> the first national park in America, Yellowstone, is primarily located in which US state? Um, pass. Wyoming. When fresh, the culinary herb parsley typically has aromatic leaves and stems of which secondary colour? Green. Correct. Which comedy actor plays Basil Fawlty in the BBC sitcom Fawlty Towers? Pass. John Cleese. Former Emmerdale actor Suzanne Shaw first rose to fame as a member of which British pop group? Um, pass. Hearsay. In what year did Scottish scientist Alexander Fleming... Out of time in this. In what year did Scottish scientist Alexander Fleming first discover penicillin, did you know? 18... 1928. 1928. Two correct answers in there, Alison. You just gave the Ballon d'Or to Madonna, the pop star, <laughs> I think, as well. First of all, but obviously, it wasn't Maradona in 2021. Uh, Lionel Messi, of course. Oh, uh, yes, of uh, course. It was Lionel Messi. Right, you've got two counters, though. And Hermione very generously left a fair few on the tipping point, so you can still do some good work here if you get them in the right place, Alison. What are you thinking? Yeah, I think I'm going to try drop zone three. We're going to go for drop zone three, yes. please. We need it on the left, I think, don't we? Yeah. Ideally. So on the left, please counter. Because that right is very sparse. And that oh. is very sparse. Come on, push, 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 push. Oh, yeah, nice. Yeah. Yeah. Need some lateral on this. Oh, no, not in the graph again. Mm. Oh. OK. Oh. They slid in the end. £100 for those two. Thank you. And let's try drop zone two. Drop zone two, please. Oh, it's flat again. Bit of lateral. The two counters Come under on. the double will be handy. Push it. Yeah. Yeah, there Ooh, you go. What? And a couple Ooh, more. Good. This could be good. It does feel like it could be strong. It's going to be good. Oh. oh! Now that black counter on the top shelf is on the slide. Come on. Could do with please, that dropping for please, you. Please, please, please. Is it going to stay there? Is it going to go? Oh, go. Oh. It never settled itself. Two counters did drop in there for you, though, Alison. Let's put that into the machine. Takes you two hundred pounds. Let's take that from the machine and put it into your bank, and that's going to leave you on two hundred and fifty pounds. Thank you. Right then, Daniel, we come to you. 45 seconds to answer as many questions as you can. Every time you get them right, I'll give you a counter. If you don't know, just say pass, OK? Thank you. That black counter has fallen. It's riding, though, so it's not going to affect anything. Right, Daniel, you ready? Yes. 45 seconds for Daniel, please. Your time starts now. The 2020 film Six Minutes to Midnight is a British war drama starring Dame pass. Judy Hoot. Dench, Stone Age and Milestones are 1970s albums by which British rock band? Pass. Rolling Stones. When red litmus paper is dipped in an alkaline solution, what primary colour does it turn? Yellow. Blue. Which Conservative MP became father of the House of Commons in 2019? Pass. Sir Peter Bottomley. At the start of a Premier League football match, how many players typically wear captain's armbands? Two. Correct. The Velocipede was an early version of which two-wheeled vehicle? Motorbike. Bicycle. Self-portrait in a velvet dress is a 1926 Pass. painting Frida Kahlo. What form of silent mantra meditation is often referred to by the initials TM? Pass. Transcendental meditation in the Harry Potter... I ran out of time with this one. Harry Potter, I love the that. A Harry Potter, Potter question <laughs> with Marnie on the show. <laughs> in the Harry Potter book series, what is the surname of Harry's friend Neville? Marnie, Long do you bottom. know? Longbottom. Longbottom, <laughs> of course. You got one right in there, Daniel. You passed a bit quick on a fair few, I, I think. I did, yeah. The yep. 2020 film Six Minutes to Midnight is a British war drama starring Judy, Judy Dench. I would have got it. If, yeah. you got, if you got to the end of it, I would have got it. But, if you'd um, let me get to yeah. the end of it, Daniel. No, my fault. <laughs> and then you pass very quickly on your Frida Kahlo question. Yeah. Self-portrait in a velvet dress is a 1926 painting by which female Mexican artist? It was Frida Kahlo. I would never have got that. Now then, you have one counter. You need four to catch Alison. Anything less and you go down home. I think uh, drop zone two is going to be my best bet. I think there's a few there at the... Uh, edge that hopefully we can get over. Drop zone two? Yes, please. Fire it up, please. One hit at this, but there's a lot there. Be flat. Need something over the top shelf. Is that the one space it's not going to go? It's natural. Oh, 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 Daniel, no. So clever, Daniel. 
They're not going to go. So all those counters stay in the machine. And, Daniel, that means I'm afraid we're going to have to lose you. We have come to the end of the round. No Mine is leading with one thousand Alison goes through with £250. Yay. Daniel with £50. I'm afraid that means we have £15. <laughs> Thanks for playing. Good luck, girls. Thank you for having oh, thank me. You. Lovely to meet you, Daniel. Lovely Thanks to so meet much. You. Thanks so much. So it's Hermione and Alison who will be going head to head after the break for the right to play for our £10,000 jackpot. Now, though, it's your, your chance to win an amazing cash prize. For £30,000, go to the website. Entries cost £2. Text win to 65433. Text costs £2 plus one standard network rate message. Call 09068 785 433. Calls cost £2 plus your network access charge. Or post your name and phone number to TP232, PO Box 7558, Derby DE10NQ. Entrance must be 18 or over. Lines close at 10am on Monday. Welcome back to Tipping Point. We have two players remaining, Hermione and Alison. Well done to both of you for getting this far. Thank We're you. about to find out which one of you is going to take on the machine for our jackpot today. Hermione's got a bit of a lead on you here, Alison. I know. Just so you're going to catch gonna up. Have, you're <laughs> going to have to catch up. Work hard. Those double counters could be crucial if you want to close the gap and see if you can get yourself into the final. In this round, you each can be asked three questions alternately. On your question, you can choose to answer or you can pass it to your opponent. If you give me a correct answer, you put the count into the machine. If you give me a wrong answer, your opponent puts the count into the machine. Whoever has the most money at the end of this round will be today's winner. They'll be playing for our jackpot. Hermione, as you are leading, you get to choose. Would you like the first question? Would you like to offer it to Alison? I'm going to go first, please. All right, first one for you. In which 2021 sci-fi film does Timothy Chalamet deliver the line, my road leads in into the desert, as the character Paul Atreides? You can pass if you're not sure. I could guess, but... I'm not 100%, so I think I am going to pass to Alison. Right, Alison. So um, we're looking for a sci-fi film from 2021. No, I, I, I've not watched it, whatever it is. So um, I'm, I'm going to have to turn absolute guess. Mm -hmm. um, a desert film. I watched one recently, and it was June. June? So I'm going to go with that. You're going to go with June? I'm going to okay. go with June. Hermione, what do you think? I could not tell you. Yeah, have you seen June? Never seen June. Never seen June. So you could be right. Let's see if you're right, Alison. It's a great steal if you are. Is the answer June? Yeah, it is. Oh, well done. Great no. answer. Yeah, absolutely I it is. I just popped into my head there. Genius. That's what we need. Oh, a moment of goodness. inspiration, Alison. Oh, so That's good. Like... <laughs> right, let's get you some money to match that answer. OK, so I'm going to try Drop Zone 2. OK, let's fire up Drop Zone 2, please. You can bring that double on the top shelf down and a few others. Yeah. I think you could do some serious damage here. Yeah? Maybe one in the middle. Yeah. In the middle. Oh. In the middle. Yep. I like a little that. gap. I, yep. think, I think you should get it. No, that should be OK. Just as long as it comes over. Oh. Oh. Oh, oh there. Oh, fantastic. Oh. oh, come on. Wow. Now that's interesting. <laughs> Amazing. Crazy. Ten for you there, Alison. Oh, Five hundred pounds. That's a huge drop right now. Brilliant. Let's take it, put it into your bank, and that certainly makes your bank look better. With seven hundred and fifty pounds, you've you. absolutely saved Hermione's lead as well. Oh no! <laughs> Kick control, Alison. Time for your first question. Known as the feel-good neurotransmitter, dopamine is a chemical compound produced in which organ of the human body? You can play or pass. I think I know it. Okay. So I'm going to play it, well, I think I understand. Yeah. <laughs> and I'm going to see the brain. You're going with the brain. I just said the brain. Hermione, you'd have gone brain too? Yeah. Let's see if you're right, Alison. You're certainly going to feel good if this is right. Is it the brain? Yeah, of course it is. Well done. Thank Nicely you. done. Thank right. you. So now what do you fancy doing? Oh. I think I would like to try drop zone three. OK, drop zone three it is. Oh, it's flat. It is flat. So it's going to bring over something top, over the top. It? Yep. Yeah. Oh, oh, oh yeah. It. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on, come on. Go, 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 go. Oh, oh. oh. So <laughs> Nearly. Just fills a few gaps, nudges a few. Right then, control comes back to you, Humani. Time for your second question. Created in 1965 by the London Government Act 1963, how many boroughs are there in London? I'm not sure. 
but I think Alison might know it, but I'm going to take a chance and pass anyway. Right, Alison. I've got no idea. Yeah, so it's going to be... I've got a figure in my head. Mm. Um, and I'm going to go for 28. 28. Yes. OK, Hermione, would you have got more than you that? You could have said 300 and I'd have probably nodded my head. OK. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Boroughs in London. How many are there? Is there 28? Oh, you weren't far okay. off. It's 32. What? Plus the City of London as well. Alison, good try. Thank uh, you. Hermione, you get the counter. Where should we go? Drop zone one, please. Let's fire up drop zone one for the first time. Ooh, as long as, as, as get not, that mystery. As long as it's not riding. Is it gonna go flat? Please. It does go. Oh, it's flat. Anything coming over the top shelf for you here, Hermione? Not looking likely. Oh, oh. very close. Hanging over. But not quite. Oh, oh. Slid and you managed to surf that one into the wind zone. Fifty pounds for that one. Well done. Let's take it from the machine and put it into your bank. Put you on one thousand four hundred pounds. Right, Alison, back to you. Time for your second question. As of twenty twenty two, which country was the last to win the FIFA World Cup in the same year as hosting it? You can pass if not sure. I've got two in my head. Um. So I'm not 100% sure, so I'm going to pass it. Right. <laughs> Into um, football? I do love football, but I'm not sure. So I think I'm just going to guess and say Brazil. Brazil? Yeah. Okay. Always a decent guess. They've won yeah, it a few times. Yeah, they've won it a few times. So Alison, who did you have in mind? I had France or Italy. France or France Italy? The... Oh, you think it might probably. have been France? Let's see. Hermione's gone with Brazil. Is the answer Brazil? No, they oh. posted it twice, didn't win. It was France in 1998. France 98. Well done, well Alison. Uh, good pass. Hard luck, Amani. Let's get a counter in and see if we can close a little bit more of this gap. Right. Let's go for two. And drop hopefully zone. it goes to the right. Drop, drop zone two, please. Oh, yes. It's on the right way. Yes. Come on. Is that silver one right. going to come over? Just get over, get over, over, over. Oh! oh. Good try. <laughs> tactic, because that's where the money is, isn't it? Right, yeah, back yeah. to you, Hermione. Time for your third and final question. In 2020, an image of J.M.W. Turner replaced Adam Smith on which denomination of British banknote? I'm going to play. You're going to play? OK. And I'm going to say the £5 note. The £5 note. All yeah. right. Uh, Alison, if Hermione passed this over, I mean, you work in a bank. Or well, you I work know. for a bank. <laughs> <laughs> so would you have said the five pound note? I would have went for the ten. You might have gone for the ten. I think I would have went for the ten, but I'm not sure. You're I'm not sure. Absolutely not sure. So you've gone for a five. Did they take Adam Smith off the five pound note and replace him with J M W Turner? Is it the five pound note? Oh, it was no the twenty pound note. Oh, twenty. Okay. Churchill's on the £5 note, and he has been since uh, 2016. I think he oh, replaced okay. Elizabeth Fry, but it was the £20 note. So it's a bit of a gift there, Alison. Right. I'm going to try drop zone three. Drop zone three, please. Let's go. Got to be accurate, though. Yeah, I know. There's so I many know. gaps. Right, on the left. Yeah, on the left. That, hit that Come black on. counter, bring the silver one down, maybe. Come on. Left. <laughs> oh. oh, no. I think you might get the one on the right. The black counter might so. go. Oh, oh, one anyway. Come on, let's get oh. Oh. Oh, I'm lucky. No damage done, Hermione, fortunately for you. Thank God. Alison, we've got <laughs> one last crack at this. One last question for you. Okay. Here's your third and final one. The Future X are a group of musicians and dancers that were discovered on which social media platform? You can play I don't know this. or you can pass it to Hermione. Yeah, I don't know it, so I'm going to pass it to Hermione. I'm going to go with the one that's taken over the world at the minute and I'm going to go with TikTok. TikTok. Alison, what do you think? Yeah, I think it would be TikTok. You think it would be TikTok? Yeah. So you had the chance to answer that. You've passed it over Hermione. Hermione, if you're right, then you're our winner and you can be playing for our jackpot. Okay. If you're wrong, Alison, you've got Fingers one crossed. last crack. Mm, good luck. Future <laughs> X <laughs> are a group of musicians and dancers that were discovered on a social media platform. Was it TikTok? 
It was. Oh, well done. Well Thank done, Hermione. <laughs> Hard luck, Alison. That means we're going to lose you. Thank you. You're giving it a great go in this round. The machine just wasn't happy, was it? It wasn't giving you anything. Not at all. Hermione, you get this last counter. Let's Lovely. see if we can get something from the machine. What are you thinking? I think I'm going to go with drop zone three. Fire up three, please. Alison's filled the top shelf nicely. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, that looks oh. good. Slams down. I'm not sure we're going to get any. That Might get one. Oh. Uh, still. Oh. It's been stubborn. Really stubborn. <laughs> Barely anything in this round. So the scores today, they were. Well done, Hermione. You are today's winner with £1,400. Congratulations to you. Alison, I'm so sorry. You've been lovely, but with £750, we have found your ticket point. Thanks for playing, Thank Alison. you so much. I've had a fantastic it's time. It's been really lovely to Thank meet you. Thank you. So, Hermione, well done. In a few Thank moments, you. I'm going to ask you to put this jackpot counter into the machine. And this one's bigger and better than all the others. If you get this one out, you're going to go home with £10,000. And if you can get it to drop one of the two doubles that's in the machine, Hermione, you'd leave with £20,000. Oh, God. Can Hermione master the machine by finding its jackpot tipping point? We'll find out after the break. Now, though, it's your chance to win an amazing cash prize. For £30,000, go to the website. Entries cost £2. Text WIN to 65433. Text costs £2 plus one standard network rate message. Call 09068 785 433. Calls cost £2 plus your network access charge. Or post your name and phone number to TP232 PO Box 7558 Derby DE10NQ. Entrance must be 18 or over. Lines close at 10am on Monday. Welcome back to the fun part of Tim Point. Hermione is today's winner and has managed to get £1,400. Nicely done, Hermione. Didn't get everything your own way in that last round. No. Uh, but unfortunately for Alison, the machine wasn't willing to pay out, which is good news for you because yeah. now it's just you and the machine and the chance to win £10,000. I've got to ask your name, Hermione. Are you named after Hermione Granger in Harry Potter? Yeah, I am actually named after her. So my sister was watching it when she was like four years old and she was obsessed with Harry Potter. So my parents were like, we'll just call her Hermione. <laughs> Amazing. So let's hope there's a copy on that. <laughs> <laughs> that would be good, wouldn't it? Yeah. How many brothers and sisters have you got? Um, I've got two sisters and five brothers. Wow, that's a I busy know. house. Is everyone named after Harry Potter characters? Oh, no. <laughs> It'd be funny if there was. That would no. be great. And you at university studying? Uh, yeah, I'm at Newcastle. And what are you studying? I'm um, studying sports science. You quite like your quizzing, though, don't you? You're quite into yeah. sort of competitive quizzing. So me and my dad watch them every night, like 4 till 6 p.m. All over and we're it. shouting at the telly. We always pause, like, the interesting bits and then wait for each other to get in the room. So, yeah. So he's going to be very proud of you coming he's and doing this. He's going to be so happy. <laughs> well, you've done a cracking job, Hermione. You really have. Thank and you're you. here now, and it's all about trying to get the jackpot counter out. Have you got any ideas about what you might like to do with £10,000 if we get it out of the machine? Um, maybe get a new car. OK. Or I'd probably go on holiday as well and take my friend with me. That'd be lovely, yeah. yeah. So either way, whatever you decide to do, let's see if we can get you that jackpot counter and you go home and have a real big celebration. Time to find out whether Hermione's going to win today's jackpot. In a few moments, I'm going to ask you to put the jackpot counter into the machine. If you want to go home with £10,000, just need to get it out again. If you want to go home with £20,000, there's two doubles in the machine. See if you can get one of them to drop with the jackpot counter. Here's how you're going to do it. I'm going to show you six question categories. For each category, you choose to play one, two or three counters into the machine. The more you play for, the harder the question's going to be. The more you win, the better chances of getting the jackpot counter out. OK. So, what are your thoughts with our jackpot counter, Hermione? I'm thinking either three or four but then four's got the double as well. So I think I might go for drop zone four. Should we do four? Yeah. All right. Fire up drop zone four, please. Oh. Ooh, OK. Hopefully that should be flat. Yeah, there yes, you go. Flat. Nicely okay. done. All that money in three, if we get enough over the top shelf for four, could come laterally. Could come with it, yeah. Hopefully you'll get some of it, because it's all connected. It's been sitting there for a very long time. There you go, there's a fair bit. Ooh. Double holes on. Five across the tipping point for you there, Hermione. Let's put £250 in. Takes up to 1650 The jackpot counter is nice and flat, just towards the left of centre of drop zone four. Right, let's have a look at your categories. Film, nature, music, history, sport and fashion. You can play in any order, so where should we start up, Hermione? Well, nature's probably not my strongest point, so I think I might get that out of the way first. Sure. And I think I'm just going to go with nature for three. OK, let's do it. Nature for three. Which typically red bird is the official bird of seven US states? Northern Cardinal, the Summer Tanager or the Crimson Rosella? 
Well, I've never heard of any of them, mm -hmm. but I know crimson obviously is a shade of red. I'm going to light up crimson, please. OK, so you want to go crimson rosella? Yes, please. Right, we're going to go with crimson rosella. So you've not heard of any of them? No, they could all be red. <laughs> I have no idea. I hear what you're saying, though. Crimson's a shade of yeah. red, so would that so be it's logic. Be red? Yeah. I'm just going to go with it. Let's see if it's right. Is the answer the crimson rosella? Oh. Uh, they're all red, actually. Oh. The cardinal. It's northern cardinal. OK. Northern cardinal. Tricky one. But it would have been a bonus had we got it, wouldn't it? Yeah, it's Let's go fine. back to the categories. So where do you want to go next? I think I'm going to go with sport for three. Right, should be a good one, this. Sport oh, for fingers three. Fingers crossed. My dad won't be happy if I get this wrong. <laughs> Which NFL team beat the Cincinnati Bengals to win the 2022 Super Bowl? The Los Angeles Rams, Tampa Bay Buccaneers or the Kansas City Chiefs? Did you follow the Super Bowl? Um, no. <laughs> OK. Do you know those ones? I've heard of the Los Angeles Rams. Yeah. And I think I've, I've vaguely heard of all of them, but I've not like, don't follow watched it any of closely. them or anything like that. I think I'm going to go with the Los Angeles Rams. The Rams? Yeah. I'm going to go with the LA Rams, please. Right, then, let's see if you've got a correct answer. Is it the Los Angeles Rams? Yeah, oh. the second Super Bowl win. Thank well God. done. I think Tampa Bay won the year before, didn't they, with um, Tom Brady as their quarterback? I've heard of him. I've heard of him. Right, three counters. Nicely done. OK. Job sign four? Yes, please. Light it up. Come on, then, on that Just jackpot need it to counter. go left. Oh, that's took not a little bad. rebound. It could work. I hope it doesn't ride. Oh, it's oh, riding. Oh, no. OK. Timing. Come on, honey. Sorry. Oh, it's right on top. OK. It's in the right ballpark, wasn't it, as well? Yeah. OK, four again? Yes, please. OK, drop same four. <laughs> that's better. Go on, yes. Oh, that's a good that's Really a good, good spot. Really good. good. Straight, straight, straight. Yeah. Nicely oh. done. Lovely, Hermione. Oh. Doubles in. Let's take as many as we can now, then. Great Very stuff. Very nice. Six across the tipping point. £300. Takes up to £1,950. And we can double it up and give you another £300 because the double dropped in. So the money's looking good. £2,250. The jackpot's moving as well, which is great. It's looking a bit bare, though, at the bottom now. We're only interested in one counter, right? Yeah. That's the jackpot. Drop zone four again? Yes, please. Fire it up. OK. Mystery. Yeah, there's a mystery there as well, of course. Oh, I think I might get it. It's going to get close. Oh. Three counters dropped in. Mystery survived for a moment. £150 will give you. Take takes up to £2,500. Jackpot counts on the edge of the top shelf. Your mystery counter's getting towards the tipping point. Okay. It's all going nicely. Back to the categories. So film, music, history or fashion. Please, can I have music for three? Of course you can, yes. Music for three, please. The 2021 UK Top 20 single, Solar Power, is by which female artist? Lana Del Rey, Dua Lipa or Lord? What, now I'm hoping as a, a youngster you'll be all over this. <laughs> I'm actually not, but I think Lord, I remember her from quite a while back and I'm not sure she's released any like new music recently. OK. Lana Del Rey could be her, but obviously Dua Lipa's quite big at the moment, so I think I'm going to go with Dua Lipa, please. Dua Lipa? Yes, please. All right, we're going to go with Dua Lipa. Solar Power. Is that a top 20 single for Dua Lipa? Fingers crossed. Oh, Lord. It was. Yeah. Oh. She had an album of the same name as well. My flatmate's going to kill me. He's obsessed with Dua Lipa, so... He would have known. He would have known it wasn't her. OK, we can still do this. Still in good shape. We've still got a number of categories to go. Let's have a look. Film, history and fashion. I think I'm going to go with history for two, please. History for two. In 1803, Thomas Jefferson commissioned explorers Lewis and Clark to mount an exposition of which continent? North America, Africa or Australasia? Well, I feel like Australasia maybe was discovered the most recently. So... Um... Yeah, I think I'm just going to go with Australasia. Yeah. Maybe. Yeah, we'll go with Australasia, please. Australasia? Yeah, I'm not okay. sure. I have no idea. Australasia? It's not going well.
Thomas Jefferson commissioned explorers Lewis and Clark to mount an expedition of which continent? 1803. Was it Australasia? Oh, no. North America. Oh, no. Thomas Jefferson, one of the founding fathers of America? No, I don't. No? OK. Not to worry. Let's go back to the categories. We've got two left. Film and fashion. We're here for fashion for three, please. Yeah, come on. Fashion for three. Launched in 2021, Lola V is a hair care brand founded by which Friends actress? Lisa Kudrow, Jennifer Aniston or Courtney Cox? Have you heard of Lola V? No. Oh. You know those actresses? I feel like, uh, yeah, I feel like Jennifer Aniston's probably got... She has got good hair, though. I feel <laughs> like maybe she's got too much going on to find a hair brand. I've never heard of the other two. So I think... We'll go with Jennifer Aniston. Jennifer Aniston? She's the most famous and... We're going with Jennifer Aniston, then? So have you not watched Friends? No, I'm not, I'm not into Friends. Everyone else watches it, but I don't know why I've not. The only one you know, and she's got great hair. She has got great hair. It's Jennifer Aniston. Let's see if it's her. Please, Jennifer. Is it Jennifer Aniston? Oh, yes. It is. Well, well done. Please. Famous for the haircut known as the Rachel, her character Rachel in oh, Friends. Oh, I've heard of her. I've heard of her. Yeah, and so she had the certain haircut, so people started going, I want a Rachel be. So it became a, okay. a thing people asked for. Got you. You got it. Well done. OK, finally. Right, drop zone four? Yes, please. Hurry up. Let's get that jackpot counter down here. Maybe the wrong way. Could work with a bit of lateral. If it's flat... I think, think it's not flat. It is oh, flat. Oh, it is flat. I think you might get a bit of movement on it, you know. It depends how heavy the jackpot is and what yes. the angle is. Go on, go on, go on, go on. Oh, yes, there we mystery. go. Mystery. Is the mystery going to go for you? Oh! Yeah, it is. And a couple of others. Three across the tipping point. £150. Takes you to £2,550. You won a prize as well, which is a family VIP safari adventure at Woburn Safari Park with lunch and an overnight stay. Oh, lovely. Amazing. Thank Amazing. That's great. £2,550. A lovely prize. We've got a little movement as well. Two more to go in. OK, lovely. Drop zone four. Uh, yes, please. Slide it up, please. So on the left now. That's all Yeah, we want it on the left. Oh, oh it's gone the wrong way now. It's just dragged itself back. I think that might ride as well. Oh, don't say yeah. that. Oh. Okay, nothing from that one. It's just going to slide up over that silver counter. Mm. One more to go. In. Four again? Yes, please. Light it up. Come on, on the left of four. Hit that silver counter. Oh, oh. Go on, go on, go on, go on. Oh, go on. it's gone the right way, but it could be riding. I think it's going to. Oh, oh! No. Money! Three riders in this round. Not helping. OK, we've got one last category, though. We saved film to last. What should we go with? I'll have film for two, please, Ben. Film for two. In the 1976 film Taxi Driver, which actor famously utters the line, you talking to me? Jack Nicholson, Robert De Niro, or Al Pacino? I recognise the line. Yeah. And for some reason, Robert De Niro rings a bell. But, I, yeah, if it's... If that's my gut instincts, I think I'm going to go with Robert De Niro, please. Yeah? Yeah. We're going with De Niro. Have you seen the film? No. No, <laughs> but you recognise the line, you kind of feel like there's something about it yeah. that reminds you of Robert De Niro. It might not be, but... Let's see if you're right. Is the answer Robert De Niro? Fingers crossed. Yeah, oh, well done. Famous scene when he's looking in the mirror. Uh, right, two counters. I don't think the jackpot's going to go with two counters. Mm -hmm. So I think we might have to go for the stack. There's a lot of money in three, isn't there? Yeah. I think we're going to go for drop zone three, please. Fire up three, please. It needs to go on the left. Yeah, that's a good spot. All right, come on. OK, let's go. What can go. we get over the top? We want this to be lucrative. Come on. No. <laughs> <laughs> Why is it doing this to me? One more to go, then, Hermione. Mm. Um, three again, please. Let's hit three. On the side. Oh, you got your okay. timing right. That's amazing. Your last okay. one. I finally got, got it right. <laughs> OK. Right, this'll do it. Come on. This'll do it. Be big for us, machine. Please. 
Yeah! Oh. Lovely. Well done. Lovely. That was great. You see what happens when you get your timing right? Yeah. 11 counters for you there. £550 goes in. That last drop was really brilliant. That's Takes a good idea. £3,100. Hermione, usually at this stage, I would offer you a trade. Three final counts for what you've got so far in the hope of getting the jackpot counter out. Given that you've already gone to drop zone three because you don't think it's coming out, I think I know what you're going to say. Yeah. I need to ask you nonetheless, would you like to take the money or the trade? I'd like to take the money, please. Congratulations.